Jeff Driscoll has only had five starts at quarterback, but he's been so productive, mainly so far as a runner in a conservative offense. Against Vanderbilt, he broke Tim Tebow's school record for rushing yards by a quarterback, a buck 77 and three. Talked to him yesterday, and amazingly, he says he feels fresh. Jim Wojciechowski joins us. That's almost impossible to be quarterback in the SEC at the halfway point and feel fresh, but he doesn't really invite contact like Tebow did, you know. No, and Chris, when you say the name Tim Tebow around here, people nearly genuflect in appreciation. Tebow last played a game at Florida in 2009, and they're still looking for a worthy successor. It's early, really early, but they may have found one in a sophomore named Jeff Driscoll. Tim Tebow is still everywhere at Florida. You never see a team play harder than we will the rest of the season. God bless. And then there's Jeff Driscoll, who is beginning to remind Gator fans of Florida's most famous number 15. Breaks loose. Driscoll. Touchdown. I mean, obviously I'm not Tim Tebow, and everyone knows I'm not Tim Tebow, but that's an honor to be compared to one of the best college football players of all time. I don't think that's fair to anybody. Tim Tebow, uh, there's only one Tim Tebow. Let's let Jeff be Jeff. A marvelous throw by Driscoll. Jeff Driscoll, you just scored a touchdown. Driscoll isn't Tebow, and that's OK. He grew up on Navy bases, including one in Japan where his little league teammates called him Godzilla. I was a little hefty as a, when I was younger, so that, they just came up with that because I was a lot bigger than they were. I hate to put you on the spot, but your dad says that you can sing Silent Night in Japanese. I can. I'm not going to do it, but I can. If I give you 10 American dollars to sing it? I don't even know if that's legal, so <laughs> can I, can, I can't CAA take rules. that. I'm not allowed to take that. He has a kid brother who knows how to press his buttons. Kind of go after the ears a little bit. His ears stick out, kind of makes him look a little goofy. I know mine are big too, but his, his really stick out, so that's kind of what I attack. Those ears didn't stop Driscoll from being voted homecoming king at his Orlando area high school or dating the captain of the Florida cheerleading squad. Let's go! Let's go! Let's go! For the rest of our lives! For the rest of our lives! Tebow had an aura about him as big as Florida field. Driscoll is more reserved. If it was up to me, I would, I would go out here and play the game and then be able to walk straight home without people noticing. Fat chance of that. Still, it turns out Jeff Driscoll is doing just fine being, well, Jeff Driscoll. But he wouldn't mind one day seeing his name and number next to you know who. That'd be an honor, but uh, not quite yet. Still got a long way to go there. What do you got to do to get that? I mean, I don't know. Obviously, a championship wouldn't hurt. Fellas, you got you would really like this guy. He's low key, he doesn't big time anybody. He showed up at our interview with a pair of torn shoes that he had stitched up himself. His idea of a perfect day, sleeping late, playing a football game, winning the football game, and then going fishing all day. Chris, he might have a spot on that boat for you. Yeah, we, we definitely like Jeff Driscoll, Gino. Not quite as much as this young lady, Taryn Moses. Jeff's girlfriend and the captain of the Florida cheerleading squad. Glamour couple here in Gainesville, huh? Yeah, 